have a whole splash pad to themselves this morning. <laughs> That's okay. You're a soggy doggy. You can dry on the walk home. Okay, run. Go through. What does the what does the soccer ball do, guys? It dies. Does it sprinkle water too? It dies. It doesn't die. So does it does it shoot water at you guys? All right, so tonight I'm trying something different, something I've never had before. But recently I've seen it on YouTube and I looked up a recipe and uh, it looks like a winner, like a tummy pleaser, I guess you could say. Rob really likes meatball subs. So tonight we're gonna have um, meatball sub bubble up bakes. First thing I have to do is cut each one of these into, I guess, four or six pieces and then line the base of this pan and BAM line the bottom of your baking dish with the cut up pieces of biscuit next we top with frozen meatballs I'm just using the um, marketplace brand from Walmart frozen meatballs I believe these are Italian pork ones next I just went liberally with a little bit of garlic parmesan and Italian seasoning and topped with some marinara sauce the one I usually use, the sweet basil and marinara, it is delicious. And then lastly, of course, we just dump a whack load of cheese on there and call it a day. No, I'm just kidding. We throw it in the oven for 35 minutes at 350. Ba-bam, bam, bam. Okay, so now we have did the cheese and I've sprinkled some of the parsley on top for a presentation. And now she's going in the oven. It's actually pretty early to be making dinner, but... Truth be told, it's looking pretty ugly out there. Uh, I think we narrowly escaped a storm when we were at the park and uh, crafting, but it's, I've heard a couple cracks of thunder and yeah. Mmm, look at this bubbly goodness. I'm actually quite excited to dig into this. Hmm, maybe I'll post a review video. Hmm, or maybe I'll just tell y'all how I like it.